Is anyone there? Come in, me. Are you there, me? Is anyone there? Yes. Come in, me. Are I'm you here. There, me? I'm here, you. Hello. It's happening. It's happening. What's up, my dudes? What is up, my dudes? Check this out. Check it. Look at that. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look. Look. Are you looking? Hang on. Look. Look at it. Look at him. Look. The Look at him. Look at him. I need to reframe the shot. Hang on. There we go, that's probably about right. Okay. There's a new shirt available now. Triple Jur.mup forward slash shop. This is of course the amazing work of Carrie, who I believe was in the chat earlier. I don't know if she's there now. If you're there, hello Carrie. Amazing work. You can go buy it right now. We've we just shot a little advert for it that will be going up on the channel soon. So you know? <laughs> You should, you should know. Hello everyone. Welcome to today's stream. Happy Tuesday. God, did we get through Monday? Mondays are a lot easier to get through with, with a Peter stream at the end of them, I tell you that. I tell you that. He makes life worth living, that, that little Austin. That was a lot of stress there, that was a lot of moving around. I wasn't quite, wasn't quite ready. You're on your third gym in the game, I'm assuming. Hello, Ben. How are you? I told oh, Peter this yesterday, but I was not feeling well mentally. This weekend and watching your content really kept a smile on my face. I want to thank you both for all the amazing things you guys do. You're very welcome, Stephen. Thank you so much. Hello, is that gonna read it too? Thank you so much for donating it. And, uh, and I hope you're feeling better, my dude. Hang in there. Life can be a bastard sometimes, but you're in with a good group of good group of guys and girls, and we're all here to support you. We also got a, a subscription there. Thank you very much to Vexleth85 for the resubscribe. Very much appreciated. Not played Pokemon since the Red Days. So intrigued to see if the graphics have improved. Maybe a little bit. Maybe a tiny, maybe a tiny little eeny weeny bit. You're on the seventh gym. God, everyone's just out doing each other. I've barely. I barely played this. I played it last night for, um, God, how long? Maybe a couple of hours? And I was just taking my time, interacting with everything, grinding, doing all the, doing all the silly stuff that I shouldn't probably do, like training up on people that didn't need, that weren't even worth my time training up on because they, they give me like two XP, but I did it. I sure did it. Pantaloons, thank you very much for the resub. Uh, we've got another one in there as well. I'm uh, trying to find it. Maybe I scroll past it. Son, ta Son tail sick. Nice. Thank you very much for the resub. Hello everyone. Hello. For those of you just joining us, brand new shirt. Artwork from Carrie. It's available. Triple jerk dot mup forward slash shop. It's a wonderful, wonderful shirt. It's a wonderful shirt. It's a fun one. If you don't enjoy this game, I would give up on new Pokemon. That's the thing, right? I'm intrigued to hear people's opinions because there's been a lot of scuttlebutt about this game. People are people people aren't too happy. It seems there's there's Pokemon missing and features that aren't there that people want to be there. But I really liked the direction they took it in Let's Go Eevee, where they simplified it all down and all your Pokemon get XP. You don't have to just get XP for the ones that are fighting. You can see the Pokemon overworld. It's respectful for people like Here me who don't have a huge amount of time for, you, for games. My dude. Looking forward to the stream. You are the best. Thank you, Stephen. You're the best. You're the best. Thank you so much. Um, so yeah, I'd be interested to hear what you think because I've 
sort of purposefully avoided all of the the negativity that's been going around online about Sword and Shield uh, because I kind of just wanted to enjoy it and I am so far and we're going to start a new game today and of course any Pokemon that we get naming rights will be reserved for chat so make sure that you are that your stream is refreshed and you are ready to type that name in there because first come first serve and we can't have any more Adolf chickens okay we can't be doing that we can't be doing that uh, Datazoid1701, thank you very much for the resub. Glad to catch one live today. Thank you, Datazoid. Glad to have you here. Glad to have you here. <sighs> ben, if you're going to catch a yeah. rubbish, I love I the new shirt. Lord oh, Lord Brosvich, don't do that to yourselves. Thank you, Steadmen, for the blips. It's a wonderful shirt. Thank you, Carrie. Carrie is in the chat. You can You can tell Carrie directly that you like the shirt. She designed it. She did a phenomenal job, as she has done with several of our shirts so far. I'm ready to go. So what made you decide on Pokemon Shield over Sword? Always nice to know what people prefer, why people prefer one over the other. I usually try to pick the one that I don't think a lot of people are going to pick. So I picked Eevee over Pikachu, because Pikachu is the obvious one. I picked Shield over Sword, because I think everyone's going to want the sword, right? That's the one that you... That's the... That's the cool weapon. Nobody wants a shield. So I thought I'll pick shield because if there's Pokemon that are exclusive to shield, then I want to have those ones so that the, all the people who have sword are like, Ben, be my friend. I need the I need the such and such. The, I can't get the the, blib, the Blibasaur. Or what, I don't know, whatever it is. This game actually has cutscenes though, which is fun. So are we ready? Mechanically, one of the best Pokemon games. However, a game based on number of Pokemon missing uh, a game, however, a game based on number of Pokemon missing Pokemon is really bad. I think I get what you mean there, Andy. There are a lot of Pokemon missing. My favourite Pokemon, Scyther, not in this game. Yeah. Gutted. I can't stay for long as it's my birthday. Some oh. attention would be most appreciated. Carrie, when happy, birthday. Tongue, lol. happy birthday! Happy birthday, Carrie! And I'm going Carrie. out soon. Have a great stream. Also, thanks everyone for being nice about the shirt. Carrie, XX. Ha XX. Carrie, happy birthday. Thank you so much for the blips. Enjoy the rest of your day, Carrie. I hope you have a lovely, lovely rest of your day. Enjoy it. Party, party, party hard. Party in the USA. Okay. Are we ready to do this thing? We're going to do it now. I'm going to press the buttons and we're going to make this happen. Are you ready? I don't want you to be scared, but I'm going to be up here. For the first time probably ever, I'm going to be up here instead of down here. I know Peter was over here yesterday. Usually I'm over here. Today I'm up here. Prepare yourselves. Here we go. Oh, it was frightening, wasn't it? Okay. I mean, obviously that one. He's white and has blonde hair. That'll do. First come, first serve. Let's do it. Give me a name. Give me a name. This is going to go disastrously wrong. Try and be fun and funny. Let's not just be as awful as possible. Okay, Lord Brotovich is in there first. Lord Brotovich in there first with a very, very conventional... Ben. Yes, that information is correct. What a great name. I know. It's all right. It's okay. I get by with it. I do what I can. Now we're watching a live stream of a live stream. There are no beards in this game, I'm afraid. Apart from that guy's beard. But you always play as children in Pokemon games, so there we go. Welcome, one and all. Welcome to the wonderful world of Pokemon. Our beloved Gala region is a wonderful place with thriving nature. Thriving nature. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon with which we share our lives. As you know, our society is able to thrive. <sighs> Pregnant pause. Ben, I would like to ask you what got into collecting Game Boys and what got you into gaming. I like seeing you post photos of your Game Boy collections. Thank you, Stephen. Um, I've said it a couple of times, but basically in regards to Game Boys, um, you reach a certain point where you become nostalgic for the things that you grew up with, and I grew up having a Game Boy. 
So I just reached the point where I had I had money from working a full time job, and I thought, you know what, I'm going to start buying these, and then it sort of uh, it sort of became something of an obsession. And, and before I knew it, I ended up with every single one of them. As for gaming, uh, I, my aunt had an original Game Boy in the early '90s. My cousin had a Sega Mega Drive and a Nintendo 64, and my friends had games consoles, so it was just sort of around, and I just played it uh, as, as it went. Uh, but I credit Final Fantasy VII as the first game that I played where I realized, ah, games are more than just sort of get the highest score. There's more to gaming than that. And that, that game I credit with sort of, that got me into games. I hope, I hope that's, uh, you find that interesting, Stephen. Thank you very much for the donation. Thanks to help from these mysterious creatures that we call Pokemon. Here we go. Yes, Pokemon are all around us in the sea, in the sky, and even with us in our towns. He's very excited, this Tony Stark guy. And those of us who choose to raise and train Pokemon to do battle and compete, dot dot dot, we call Pokemon Trainers! I hope you're all doing that at home. Pokemon Trainers! Yeah, Pokemon Trainers! Oh, but I'm getting carried away. Please allow me to introduce myself. My name is Rose. That's an unconventional name for a man, but I like it. And it's a pleasure to be here. Now turn your gaze to the Galar region's greatest Pokemon trainer, your undefeated champion. It's time for Champion Leon's exhibition match. Oh, look at this guy. Oh. I will say bad facial hair though. Bad bad facial hair. Not not a fan of that. Yeah, he's got like a gang sign he does. That's like his signature move. Exhibition or not, Leon, your pristine record is about to end when I beat you today. You know I don't lose battles, Raihan. Charizard, Dynamax! Look at this boy! I nearly called the stream, damn, that's a thick-ass boy, you know, from the meme. Uh, but I didn't in the end because I knew that if we put ass in the title, it would be, uh, it would be demonetized. So there we go. If Pokemon has taught me anything, it is that it is desirable to capture animals and force them to fight. Yes, that is the message here. They should have stopped with the Generation 2 Pokemon. I agree. Gen 2 is sort of where I fell off, but I still like to try and play the new ones. There's me. Hello, hello. It's my best friend, Hop. Oh, that's your flash new phone, Ben. Were you watching Lee's exhibition match on it? Bet you can't cheer him on with your hands full. Excuse me? You know the only way to properly cheer on Lee would be with his famous Charizard pose. Throw up those gang signs, Hop. No, he's not doing it. So this is an interesting one because the Gala region is sort of moulded after, after the UK. So, for the first time in, in, in Pokemon history, there's a lot of uh, British vernacular in this game, including the spelling of mum down there being M-U-M instead of M-O-M, which, which is a fun change. They spell mum the correct way. Exactly, Molly, exactly. Hop, didn't expect to see you here today, dear. Isn't this the big day? Yeah, that's exactly why I came running over to get Ben. <laughs> Gex it. <laughs> yes, yes. Um, never mind watching that match now. I've got it recording at home anyway. I record all my brother's matches. AJ Springer, thank you very much for the resub, my dude. Uh, where's my mouse? You typed a message. The only irritating thing about this game has entered the room. Hop can kindly jump off a cliff. Oh, poor Hop. Does Brexit exist in the Pokemon universe? I suppose we will find out. Here's hoping, right? It's so much fun. It's so much fun in real life. I hope it's in games too. I 
I've got it recording at home anyway. I record all my brother's matches. Come with me, Ben. He should be here any minute. And Lee always brings presents when he visits, so I wouldn't forget that bag if I were you. Now I've got to run. See you at mine later. Bye, Hop. Don't hurry back. Do do. Now I sat here for a for for an amount of time that made me feel kind of stupid last night. You need to press a button to make him stand up. So I just sat there like an idiot, just to, just peering out the door. I need to do this. There we go, and we're up. Marie. Hey, my dude, Gurus. It's a fireplace that's built into the house. It keeps things warm in the harshest winter. Ben, do you have a few favourite Pokemon? Also, my name's Reese. Just got a confusing username. Going to change it when I get the chance. Okay, Reese. Um, do I have a few favourite Pokemon? I like. They're all from the original 151, obviously. Scyther is my boy. Um, I like Vaporeon. Um, I am a a. A Mewtwo slash, uh, not Mewtwo, I'm a Meowth slash Persian fan. I think those are cool Pokemon. And then obviously I like, I like most of the original 151. But those are, I think those are, those are cool Pokemon that may not necessarily be tactically good in an actual battle. But I think they look cool and I always like them. Brooklyn Brawler smacked me. Thank you for the resub. I hope you're okay. Right, let's head out. I'll talk to my mum first. Rushing off in that state, Ben. Didn't Hop say you should bring your bag? And I saw it in your room. And don't forget to grab a hat for the weather. Okay. Oh, my room's right here. That's handy. You grabbed your dad's old bag. Where's dad, huh? Huh? Where's, where's dad? Huh? Looking good. Don't, I've seen the Meowth in this game, don't worry. There's, I don't know what they've done to it. But I went, there's a mystery gift function in this game. And for some reason last night when I did a mystery gift, it gave me the regular Kanto region Meowth rather than the weird Gala region mouth that looks like a goblin. There we go. It's Physics Jim, thank you for the resup. Thank you so much. Let's see if I can access it now. I probably can't yet actually. I've got like no options. Right, out we... Where's the door? Out we go. They all died in the war. Yeah, apparently so, right? Apparently all the dads are dead because of the war. Look at it. How idyllic, huh? How idyllic. Uh, yes, there is a goblin cat in this game. Can someone post a photo in the chat of the... Uh, or a link to a photo of the... The Gala region Meowth, because it's just... Ugh, I don't like it. I don't like it. Hello, Hop. Ha, 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 ha. Have a look at you, Ben. That old bag looks like it could pull you over. At least we know that it should hold anything Lee might bring, even if it's as big as a Snorlax. <laughs> oh, Hop. You're so funny. Get a load of this idiot. A Wooloo. But what's it doing here? We're just gonna, yeah, we're just gonna watch it do that then. Hey, you silly Wooloo. I see what you're up to. Don't go using tackle on the fencing. Now you listen. No going past that fence, no. Everyone knows there are scary Pokemon living in the slumbering weald. Meh? What part of the UK is this supposed to be? I, I, do, I don't know. Countryside, let's say Yorkshire. Now that that's taken care of, how about it, Ben? Let's race. But I can make it to my house first, what with you lugging about that big old bag. What? You get to run in a cutscene, so that's not exactly fair, is it? And then the sheep just rolls along afterwards. There we go. Um, this this map is amazing. The, 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 the place names are very English. There's Motostoke, which is particularly exciting. Uh... And Barlam, thank you very much for the resub. Nothing more wholesome than making animals fight each other for money. Thanks for eight months of wholesome goodness, lads. All asses. Thank you, Embalum. Thank you so much. Okay. Definitely Yorkshire, says Cecil Prompts. I feel like she has a vested interest in it being Yorkshire, but there we go. The Gala Mine. Turfield. Hullbury. 
We're currently in the town of... Well, there's Wedgehurst there. We're in the town of Postick, which is fun. Um, as we go up here, my favourite one, not Hammerlock. Where is it? Stow on side. It's so close. It's so close. St it's Stoke close to being a historic town. Stow on side. What we got over here? Spikemouth. Surchester. Uh, Ballonlee. Which is fun. And up here, it's Wyndon. Do you re do you recognise Wyndon? Do you recognise Wyndon there? You know, the capital city of Gala. Wyndon. Sort of a combination of perhaps Windsor and that other city that, that begins with Dun, or ends in Dun, I should say. Wyndon. Anyway, there we go. It is subtle. It is subtle, Alex. It is. Okay. Over we go. Ba -e -e -e. Namu. Welcome to the town of Postic. Lovely. Hey my dude. I've already spoken to all these people in my own game, so I won't I won't waste your time interacting with every single individual vo uh, person. Don't worry. Look at Hop's house, Jesus. Does your house look like this, Cecil Pumps? This is this what all Yorkshire houses look like? It's huge! There's a walrus Pokemon nowadays. It's called Walrain. I think we should compel you to find one. You don't need to compel me at all, boring loner. If we can find one, we will. We might not get to it this week, but I'll do my best. Mum, is he here? There you are, at last hop. Oh, and you brought Ben. Oh, and you brought Ben along. Oh, hello, dear. Yeah, yeah, but where's Lee? Have you got him crammed in a cupboard? He's still not here yet for the hundredth time. Honestly, Hop, you must learn some patience. He's probably only just arrived at the station in Wedgehurst. And that's where I'm going. You know Lee is hopeless with directions. Um, I'll make sure he doesn't get lost on the way. Okay. Oh, will you? Yes, that's probably for the best. Anything. Anything. Just to get you out of here, Hop. You've got to come with, Ben. You've still never met my big bro, right? You can't miss out on your chance to meet the undefeated champion. I can't wait to meet him. He sounds amazing. I'll wait for you on the route. Here we go. Send for the man. Thank you for the resub. Hi. Hi, send for the man. Hello. Right, let's go find Hop. But first I'm going to go snoop around their house. Oh, we've got old people here. Oh, look at the boys. They're posters of the top three most popular Pokemon in Gala. Of course. Of course it's original 150 Pokemon. It wouldn't be any of those weird new ones, would it? He's got a switch, though, look. See that? A little poke We've got a little switch down there. Oh, out of my face. you got enough hats, my dude. This guy is serious about fitness. Look at those dumbbells, though. Wow. Which Pokemon are you planning on calling Babs Piss? As I said at the beginning of the stream, AJ, it's first come, first serve for naming Pokemon. So just get ready. Hats, you're right. Just get just get ready to, to suggest a name. First come, first serve. That is what we will name the boy or girl that we end up getting. That, that place over there, by the way, that's Wedgehurst. That's the other town. Look how close it is. Great. One Pokemon come out of, come out can could come out of nowhere if you walk through patches of tall grass. I've got Wooloo with me, so I'm ready for battles against wild Pokemon, of course. But not you, Ben. So we'll steer clear of the tall grass as we go. Alrighty. I like the music in this game as well. I think the battle music is good, even though I've heard it about forty times so far. It's not, it's not yet frustrating me. Okay, so I'm not allowed to go that way yet. No one into that tall grass for you if you've got no Pokemon of your own, mate. Mate. I haven't got any mate. Should we go see your brother then? I'm going to beat you there. There's a Charizard. Can I have it? Wow. 
His facial hair is just as bad in real life. Gang sign! What's that? Gang gang sign. Everybody do the everybody do the sign. Hello, hello, Wedgehurst. Your champion Leon is back. I promise I'll keep doing my best to deliver the greatest battles for you all to watch. It's our unbeatable champion. Leon, you and Charizard are the greatest. Well, thank you for that. I hope you'll all carry on training up your Pokemon and never shy from battle. Then come challenge me for the champion title. We're on it. We've all been working on our battle skills just like you've taught us to, Lee. Oh, bit chuggy. Bit chuggy. But that Charizard of yours is too strong for the likes of us to take on. We're just me and... What's that guy doing? Oh, I'm covering him up. Hang on. Hang on. Look at him go. Look at that green guy go. What's that guy doing? But that Charizard of yours is too strong for the likes of us to take on. What's this? Hungry for battle. Okay. Too true that Charizard is blazingly strong, but other Pokemon can be strong as well. He's using Belly Drum. Nice. That's why I want the strongest of challenges to fill the gym challenge and come battle me. My wish is for Gellar's trainers to work together to become the strongest in all the world. Groar. Lee. Hop. So my number one fan in all the world has come out of his way to pick me up. Out of his way. It was so far. It was so far. Look at you, Hop. I reckon you've grown exactly an inch and a quarter since the last time I saw you. <laughs> Hit the gym challenge. Fill the gym challenge. Yeah, apparently that's, uh, that's what they're calling collecting all the gym badges in this game. It's called the gym challenge. I'm not sure why. Bingo, that's the sort of sharp eye that kept you undefeated for so long, eh, Lee? And these bright eyes over here. These bright eyes. The cape is a bit much for you. <laughs> you wait until you see the back of it, Addy. Because it's just covered in sponsorships. It's so weird. You must be Ben. Am I right? I've heard loads about you from my little brother. I'm the Gala region's greatest ever Pokemon champion. Modest as well. And a massive Charizard fan too. People call me the unbeatable Leon. Come on, Lee, and you, Ben. Bet I can beat the both of you back home. That hop, always wanting to be the best, isn't he? With a proper rival of his own, I bet he'd push himself to become something truly special. Well, everyone, there you go. Look, you can see his sponsorships. Do you see him? Look at all his sponsorships. It's so weird. I bid you farewell for today, but don't you fret. I'll always be around to make sure everyone in Gala can have a can have a champion time. Oh, can have a champion time. Got the cadence wrong. And then he just sprints away. That's fine. Come on, Lee, you promised us a present, so out, out with it. You brought Ben and me Pokemon. You did, didn't you? I know you must have. Right then, the greatest gift from the greatest champion. I really do like this guy's modesty. It's showtime, everyone. Oh boy, what's he gonna do? So you can take a good look, you two. Oh, the grass type, Grookey, which sounds like a slur. The fire type, Scorbunny. And the water type, Sobble. Look at him go.
I will I will publish a poll um, for for people to vote which starter. I will say that I chose um, Sobble, the water Pokemon in my own game, because of course I did. I mean, look at it. It's just sad and grumpy all the time. It's the be It's objectively the best Pokemon. Let's um. Let's set a let's set a poll going, shall we? Hang on a second. Uh, okay, here we go. I'll stop it. Dismiss that warning. Which starter will go for Fire Bunny, Sad Puddle? Monkey boy. Create pole. Okay. Are you ready? Are you ready, guys? Here comes the pole. There it is. Everyone get voting, please. Arches Arches Zephram. Arch Zephram. Thank you very much for the resub. Nine months. You hero, Arch Zephra. Thank you so much. Okay, there's the poll. Everybody vote, please. Let's have a look what we've got so far. Oh, it's it's so close. It's like 36, 34, 30. But this is democratic. I'm going to pick the... It looks like Monkey Boy's winning. I'm going to count to 10, and whoever is in first is, is going gonna, is gonna to be chosen. One... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's a landslide. It's Monkey Boy. Monkey Boy is getting chosen. We're going with Grookey. We're going with Grookey. Boo! <laughs> That's democracy, Bootsy. I'm sorry. I have I, I have to play as Grookey. I just let you guys choose. Sad water. <laughs> I know. I know. Hello? Oh, I'm playing. There we go. Hello, Grookey. The grass-type Pokemon Grookey, eh? It's soothing. Like a nice long walk in the woods. Is it? Yes! You chose Grookey! Would you like to give Grookey a nickname? Yes. <laughs> okay. Dead Eye Duck. Dead Eye Duck is in there first. It's a good one. Bird seeds. Bird seeds has been added to your party. There we go. Grookey is dangerously close to a slur. You're right, so bird seeds is best, I think. I want to be the very best like no one ever wears. Oh, hello. To catch them is my real test. To train them is my cause. Rory Seagull. Thank you so much. You will be the very best. And we will make bird seeds. We will make a success of bird seeds. Yes! Little high five. I should have gone for a full power high five and just slapped it into the floor. Poof. Get that weak out of here. Get that weak stuff out of here. Ugh. So it'll be grookey for you. Nice one. Then I'll go with Sobble. You're this is something they've changed up for this. In the, in the earlier games, your rival always used to pick the the type, uh, the type of uh, starter that your starter was weak to. So logically he should have picked Scorbunny and then he could have just melted my bird seeds and won the battle, but he's picked the one that's weak to mine, which is a nice little confidence boost at the start of the game, but it's, it's still, you know, there we go. Whatever, I'm okay with it, I'm not that fussed. People who take that so personally, it's okay, don't worry. I'm aiming to be the next champion, so be ready. You and I will be doing some serious training. Can we have another referendum on starter Pokemon? Chris, it's decided. If we have a people's vote, there's no going back now. We can't do it. We voted. We will make a success of, of bird seeds. Okay? Got to do it. Thank you very much for watching, Josh. Take care of yourself. That's why I brought along these Pokemon for you and Ben, so the two of you can battle and train and grow stronger together to try to reach me. Oh, poor Scorbunny just abandoned there. Grexit means Grexit. Yeah. 
and you'll come with me. Charizard will show you the ropes. He's strict, but real strong and real kind, too. Meh. Alright, enough of this trainer nonsense for one night. Dinner's ready, children. Bring along your Pokemon and let's all eat. I hope that's... I wonder what meat that is. Hopefully it's meat-free barbecue. I don't really want to know where they get the meat from in the Pokemon universe. Oh my god, look at the size of those kebabs. Look at the size of those kebabras there. Bling, bling, bling. Star Wars games and Pokemon games? You're really in my wheelhouse here, Triple Jump. We're doing it for you, Reese. It's all for you. The next day. You spent the whole night with that new partner of yours, right, Hop? Sounds a bit sexual. Harry, Christopher, Robin, thank you very much for the resub. My dude or dudette, thank you so much. You two getting on all right? Understanding one another? Maybe even build up a bit of what? There's a lot of subtext here. Of course I have, Lee. We spooned all night. Ben's made fast friends with his groupie... So, I'm sorry, with his bird seeds too. Then listen up, new trainers. Believe in yourself and your pocket mans. If you trust in one another and carry on battling side by side long enough, this guy's had like three different voices now, then someday you might even become worthy rivals for me, the undateable champion. So what, so what are you looking at him for, Lee? I'm the one who could be coming to challenge you. If you think Ben might be able to challenge you, I guess he's my first rival, innit? But I'm not planning to lose to him and miss out on my chance to beat the undateable champion. Just having a Pokemon with with you doesn't make you a, tr a real trainee. All right, Hop. Rude boy. Proper trainers raise their Pokemon up to be first rate in battle, too. Oh, and you think you're worthy of calling yourself such a proper trainer? Already, Hop. Yeah, get him, Leon. Guess I'll be the judge of that. Let's see how you handle yourself in a battle against your friend if he's up for it. What do you say? Willing and ready to take Hop on in the first ever Pokemon battle of your life? Of your life? Yes. Believe in your partner Pokemon and care for them too with all of your heart and your maybe your Wilson. No, don't do that. Don't do that. Do these two things and only those and I'm certain you'll learn to choose the moves that suit your Pokemon. All right. And more importantly, to have a champion, to have a champion time battling with. I've never heard him. I've never heard the phrase champion time before. To describe a good time. Okay. Goodbye, Chris Hardway. Thank you for joining. Why is Hop being such a gatekeeper? He really is, isn't he? Looks like everyone's on board. Pokemon and trainers alike. Let's do this. I've watched every match that Lee's ever had. I've read every book and magazine he left behind at home too. I know exactly what to do. <laughs> oh, Jesus. It's happening. You are challenged by Pokemon trainer Hop. Send our Wooloo. Go bad seeds. A Pokemon battle it is then. I've got two partners with me. See, I deliberately put myself up here because I don't think it covers up any, any HUD or anything. So hopefully I'm in the best place. We've already got Scritch. Hit him with a Scritch! Ah, my face. Ben, would you like a kind of gold, silver, let's go get, go type game? Yes, I really would, actually. A simplified version of Pokemon gold and silver would be... I would be all over that. be awesome. Is the joint stream on Saturday? Yes. Before we kick Hop's ass, let me just clear this up quickly. So, usually our joint Blaze It stream is on a Thursday and it's on uh, YouTube. We're doing something slightly different this week. There's no YouTube live stream on Thursday. Instead, we are doing a charity live stream right here on Twitch uh, in aid of the Cats Protection League, who we've spoken about a few times before, and their Pawsome Players video game initiative. So we'll be here between 4 and 7 p.m. GMT, playing a few games, having a few laughs, and all donations will go straight to the Cats Protection League. Uh, we've tweeted and posted on Facebook about it, all the information, and we'll continue to do so close to the time. But don't come to YouTube on Thursday expecting a stream, okay? Saturday, Twitch will be here, 4pm. For the cats. For the cats. Okay, let's kick his ass. Oh no, I tried to run! 
fight. Don't forget to wear your shirt. I won't. I've been told that we we may be being sent a few things that we can actually give away as well. So I'm not sure what that involves, but if you're interested, do come along. We'll try and we'll try and get some some cat goodies to you. Not cat treats. Maybe cat treats. I don't know. Maybe you like those. I don't know. There you go. Bird seeds used scratch. First blood. Bird seeds has killed his first monster. Would you like a Let's Go style game to ease you into a gen you don't necessarily like? So I couldn't get into any of the DS ones. Like that was the point where I sort of completely dropped off. I missed the Game Boy Advance one, so I'd love to re I'd love to experience Ruby, Sapphire, Emerald, whatever, in a Let's Go style game. Um, but I have no interest in Pearl, Diamond, Black and White. Those ones, like I just pfft, I just don't care about those. I liked Sun and Moon; they were good. Um, but the DS ones, not interested. <laughs> Should we do a Nuzlocke? The Tick cartoon, please remind me what a Nuzlocke challenge is. Is that where, when it faints, you have to release it because it's dead? Is that what it is? So it's sort of like a permadeath? Oh, there we go. So I think AJ's just clarified there. Play under the fainting equals death rules. Is that it? Is that is that how it works? There's something to do with like catching Pokemon as well. Like, how does that work in a Nuzlocke challenge? You guys are going to have to tell me. Branch poke! Yes! It's not over yet. I've added another trusty ally to my team. Oh, it's the sad puddle. Permadeath not healing in combat. Catch one of every type, but only the first one you find in an area. Oh god. Okay. Let's do a branch poke. He's not going to like that. Pound! Pound! Oh, that noise. Critical hit. <laughs> Given that this is a slightly chiller game than the rest of them, how about we do a modified Nuzlocke challenge that isn't really a Nuzlocke challenge? In that we can catch whichever Pokemon we like, we can heal when we like, but if it faints, it is dead. Okay, does that sound good? So we'll do a modified version, because I don't want to stick to so many rules. That sounds complicated. Well, it's not complicated, but you know. I want to have fun. We want to have fun. Birdseeds is level 7. What a big, strong boy. You beat my two Pokemon with your one? You and Birdseeds are too much. I'm not going to kill Birdseeds, but his... His... His whatever it's called, Sobble. His Sobble is dead. His Sad Puddle has died. Well, that was a shock. I guess I now know. No, now, no, now, no. Brow, brown cow. Why, Lee thought he should give you a Pokemon too. You and your Pokemon all fought hard. Let me always want to let out Charizard and join. Are you joking? You see the size of these Pokemon? They're like half a foot tall. Charizard would just stamp on them. Goodness. Good effort out there, bird seeds. Why don't I get you all sorted? Oh, thank you. And Ben, you've got you've got real promise. In fact, I've got a fat oh, favor. You can spell mum right, but you can't spell favor. Be a real rival to Hop, would you? Push him. <laughs> and make the both of you stronger. I already want to get stronger and stronger. Hello, Tetra Web. Welcome to the welcome for the two that welcome into the stream. Welcome. It's been a long day. We've we've spent. We were filming from 10 a.m. to about half two. We were shooting a couple of main menu episodes, including our Christmas episode. And it's just, it's taken a lot out of me. It's been a busy day, busy day. I'm now staying late at work for the for stream time. I love stream time. I'm just, just, a, bit, just a bit sleepy. It's okay, it's okay though. We're all having, we're all having fun. <laughs> you see me battle now, Lisa. Come on, you've got to let me take on the Pokemon gyms. You join the gym challenge. You think you're ready for the single greatest competition in the Galar region? Huh? Not putting the cart before the rapidash there, little brother. 
If that's really what you want to do, you two have a whole lot you need to learn about Pokemon. Especially your friend Ben. Before you think about getting gym badges, best to think about getting a Pokedex. A trainer's Pokedex helps them learn lots of things about all the Pokemon out there, including their strengths. But it's more than just a collection of data. You know. It's a record of a trainer's love and passion for Pokemon training. I think this guy does things to his Charizard. I think he might. Right, right, we get it. Pokedex is then. We're on it! Looks like it's off to the Pokemon Research Lab for you and me, Ben. That's the kind of enthusiasm a trainer needs. I'll let the professor know to expect you. I'm going to be the next champion. Yeah, stop saying I'm going to be the next champion. It's l literally all you say. Oh, right, let's go say goodbye to... Oh, Ben, did you hear that just now? Look at the Butterfreeze up there. The gate's open, and the Wooloo that was there. It was tackling the fence pretty hard earlier. You don't think it actually broke through there, do you? Do you? But it's off limits. Nobody's supposed to go in there. I remember the professor's granddaughter went in once, and she came back in a real state. And that was nothing compared to the earful she got from the professor afterwards. Oh my goodness. Ben, what do you say? We've got to save the stupid sheep. Let's do it. Come on, Hop. Yeah, come on, Hop. Let's go. Let's go get the sheep boy. No time to tell my mum where I'm going. If you are connected to the internet on the Switch, get me out. Don't worry, Rory, I'm going to do it. I don't think I'm allowed to do it yet. No. But soon I will, I promise. Let's go to the spooky woods. Slumbering Weald. Oh, that mystery music. <laughs> One hop this time. That Wooloo, where do you think it got off to? Well, I'm assuming it went down the path, but there we go. Don't find that Pokemon soon, this might be trouble. Here we go! Uh. Ah! Oh my god, it's a squirrel thing! A squavert! A squove! A squoved! Listen to this banging, this banging music, you ready? Hope you enjoyed that. I sent bird seeds. Na, 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 na. Look at me, look at me, look at me stealth it. Shh. No Final Fantasy VII battle music. No, but what is though? That game is unparalleled. We bam. Ooh, a spooky bird! Mm. A rookie D. Tells you how much damage your moves do. The user attacks the target by poking it with a sharply pointed bright. So a spear then. Okay. It's not very effective. You're not very effective. Oh god. What did it do? Did it peck me? I don't like it. Let's let's scratch it. Oh no, the bird is gonna eat bird seeds, you're right! We've gotta avoid all birds. If if okay, new rule, if we encounter any birds, we have to run. Because bird seed will be consumed by the birds. There's there's our custom Nuzlocke challenge there, it got a bit more complicated. Avoid all birds. Do, 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 do. Hello? 
Did you hear that? Is that a Pokemon crying out, do you think? Why is he smiling? What a lunatic. Oh. No! Okay, it's fine. It's a squirrel. It's a squirrel. We're okay. A squavert. Go bad seeds. Did it? Well, all these are effective, apparently. Let's go for that one. I just feel like this game was aimed at kids more so than previous. I think you're right, Ollie and Ware. It's a good pun. I like that. I think you're right. I think they just... After the, the, the success of Pokemon Go, I think they realised that actually... You know, some of the Pokemon games, they're quite tough. They're, they're, they're fine. You know, people who grew up with them... It's okay, and I, I don't want to take anything away from the intelligence of children. But uh, they could certainly have been made more accessible as game development has changed and evolved. And I think they're doing that now. I'm not against it. Like, I, I quite like the new changes because, as I said earlier, like they're just respectful to people like me who don't have a lot of time to dedicate to these games. Um, but yeah, definitely. They, they, are, they are very kid-friendly. Far more so than before. Based on personal experience, squirrels will also eat bird seeds. What? Who are we going to fight then? We're never going to be able to train up at all. At this rate. Oh god, it's so spooky in there. Come on, Ben. That Wulu might be in real trouble. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, uh. The fog's a bit much for me. Oh god. Now this bit is super interesting because I got big sort of Final Fantasy vibes from this bit. You'll d maybe you'll see what I mean. It's not specific to Final Fantasy, but it's an interesting way to start a Pokemon game. I've never really experienced this before. Yeah, that's good. This is mad. I can't even see my own hand in front of my face. I think I get why this place is off limits. Look at it! What in the... So it starts you off by just fighting against the game's legendary Pokemon, which I think is a, I think that's a really cool... I thought that was really cool. I liked this. I liked this a lot in a mysterious area that you shouldn't be visiting yet. Like, it's, it's cool. And look, I tried to poke it with a branch. Nothing. It, it's, it's unfazed. The move has no effect on it. Get him. Get him. Oh. <laughs> Get the stick, boy. If he dies, he dies. I know Embalum. Don't worry. Bird seeds will not die here today. I can't see anything. You okay? <laughs> we get it. You vape. You vape. We get it. God. Growl at it. I don't know. <laughs> it doesn't even care. <coughs> oh, you smoke weed. We get it. Jesus. You don't have to. You don't have to do it like that. Oh, <laughs> are we good? <laughs> oh, that's better. Anyway, that's that bit. I just thought it was cool. I thought it was a nice. Oh, so I died now, technically. So that's it. It's game over. Game's finished. I died. So that's the Nuzlocke challenge. I'm, I'm gone now. It was fun while it lasted, wasn't it? It's, it was fun while it lasted. I'm just going to have a drink. Um, great stream. Thank you, Lord Rothfish. Thank you. Uh, GG, well played. Thank you. Thank you. Can we just be a wild grookey then? Maybe. We'll keep playing. Hop! Ben! Oh, here he is. Here he is. Lee, how'd you manage to find your way here? Your pants with directions. You always get lost. Oh, 
I've been waiting ages for you two and you never showed. Of course I came looking for the both of you. Wait, where's the Wulu? We were trying to rescue that Wulu. You idiot, look. Charizard's found it. The little chap's just fine. Though all of you had fainted by the time I found you here. Oh god, does that mean Birdseed's fainted as well? Surely he's just talking about us as people, right? Are we losing bird seeds immediately? But it took courage to come in here all the same. And I can understand well enough why you did it. You did good, Hop. And Ben was also there. <sighs> I thought we'd had it when that weird fog started rolling in and that mad Pokemon at attacked. Attacked. But at least it wasn't all for nothing. Attacked by some mad Pokemon. What are you talking about, Hop? Seems loads stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen. It just had this sort of presence. Our moose didn't even touch it. Your moose passed right through it. Hmm, so the fearsome Pokemon, they say, live in the slumbering world. Are they actually illusions or anything? Something to get strong enough and maybe the two of you could be the ones to reveal the truth. <laughs> Someday. Oh, excuse me. For now, let's simply get out of this place. You'll be all right now that I'm here with you. You'll be all right here now that I'm here with you. You'll be fine. I'll look after you. Me and my Charizard. Forever. You're all right now. Anyway. Even if we'd... Even if we did catch an earful from Lee. What an experience. This will make a pretty fine first page in the tale of my legend. What is this family? This is weird family. These guys, good lord. Don't forget to tell your mum we're off to Wedgehurst now. She'll go spare if you leave without a word. Even worse than Lee just did. Well, that's one I need to add to my list. I'm making a list of all the Britishisms in this game because we're making a video about Pokemon Sword tomorrow and I want to tell Peter about all the Britishisms that are in the game. So let me just add that real quick. Let's see. She'll, she'll go spare. There we go. She'll go spare. Excellent. There we go. Got it. Never go full spare. You're right. Off we go. Postic. Let's go tell my mum. Oh god, hello. Look, he's even got little buds down there for the for the for the sexy number. For the sex number. You must be this British to play, you're right, Stephen. Hello! Tum Tum! Nice. Well now, isn't Grookey just as call it he's got a name! Uh. And yes, I heard the news from young Leon. I'm glad someone bothered to tell me. Off to Wedgehurst, aren't you? <laughs> I thought she was about to shake his hand. Very British. Goodbye, mother. See you soon. Bit of pocket money for your journey. Buy yourself a little something at the Pokemon Center. Maybe some potions or something. Remember that bird seeds will battle to the very end for you. So don't go, don't you go pushing the poor deer too hard. Tum tum. And you, bird seeds, look after my little Ben. That's me. That's what they call me. Come home to rest any time that you need. After all, east or west, home is best. Any of you ever heard that heard that phrase before? I've never heard that before. What's she... Oh, Ben. Ugh. <sighs> What's he like? What's he like though? Nice wellies, mum. Those are cool. Flower wellies. Oh, that's me. That's the wrong button. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Oh, uh, oh there we go. We're up. She just wants to make sure you don't end up a boring person. I know. Every mum's worst nightmare. Huh? Off we go. On our adventure. Oh, uh, Lord Brotovich, which which sex number is it in twenty minutes' time? 
Is it, is it Brisbane? Are we doing Brisbane again? I think it's Brisbane, isn't it? Oh god, here we go. This is quite the big step, you know. My my first step towards becoming the next... I can't wait to just beat this guy over and over again. Guess I'll probably train up Sobble a bit by having a battle against Pokemon in the tall grass. You should get yourself to the building with the purple roof and the great red and white ball. M mark out on front. We're doing the wind and sex number. We can do the wind and sex number for sure. Everybody get ready for the wind and sex number in 20 minutes. That's the Pokemon Research Lab. Okay, see ya. See ya, bud. Okay. Mystery gift. Here we go. Get a mystery... Oh, no. Am I connected to the Wi-Fi? I don't know if I am. Yeah, let's see. I don't know if I'm connected to the office Wi-Fi. It might be clever, because I've connected it before. So, hopefully it'll do it. Oh, good. Well, that's good, isn't it? Meow! We're gonna free Meow! And it's not the weird Meow either. It's the boy. It's your boy. Sparkly Jim. Go check out your party. I will. Dun, 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 dun. I will. I'll name him in a second. Everybody get ready. Uh, oh, what did I do? No. Meow. I don't know if I can name him. He's just sort of arrived called Meowth. Do I have to take him to the, to the special name changing man? Because it doesn't look like I can do anything here. Yeah, he's just called me out. Hmm. Hmm. Nope. Oh, he's got a ribbon. Oh. Meowth the Pokemon fan. Okay, well, can't name that for some reason. Never mind, we got a Meowth now. That's good. Okay. Into the grass. So not only can you see Pokemon above ground, but there's, there's some, the occasionally less common Pokemon in an area when you step into grass. You see that exclamation mark? That means that they're running around there trying to get you. And you'll usually encounter a Pokemon that's, 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 that you wouldn't see above ground. So they're worth trying to get. We will catch this one though, the the grubbin. Let's give it a scratch first. Oh my god, what? That's oh, fine. Didn't hurt at all. The mystery meowth can't evolve. What? What a cop out. Okay, here we go. Let's catch this weird little thing. Come on. Yes. We do have five Pokeballs. Grubbin was caught, but he won't be called Grubbin for long. Oh, yes, I would. Okay. Name time. Go. See, I'm very, I'm very aware that people were waiting until just before it let me name. And then they were typing their name in. Which is cheating. You only go when I say go. Okay? <laughs> so there's a few names in there and I just don't know which one to... I don't know which one to choose now. Meowth can't evolve because it is a long cat. Oh yeah, it is, isn't it? It does the Gigantamax thing. So this is a this is a female grubbin. Just this once, Mr. McBadbat, I'm going with your name, even though I know you posted it before I even asked for it so that it would pop up first. Don't you do that anymore, okay? You gotta wait until I say go. So it's fair. 
but I will do yours just for this, just this once. In fact, I can't because it's too long. The name is too long. So we're going to go with Vexleths instead, who I believe also jumped the gun slightly. I'm on to you. I'm on to you both, okay? I'm typing Vexleth. That's not the name that was suggested. The name that was suggested was Puddles. I'm not sure of the significance, but Puddles came first. So Puddles is the name of our weird thing. Puddles has been added to your party. There we go. There we go. Bumface is such a cool name. Don't worry, you might get to name it Bumface at some point. I found a potion. Alright, we don't want to catch any birds because birds are scary. Show me that mystery Pokemon that's in the grass. There we go. What we got? What we got? What we got? What we got? It's a Caterpie! We know that one! We know that one! Get it. Catch that pee. Ooh, if you have data from Let's Go Eevee or Pikachu at the next train station, you can get a Pikachu or Eevee, depending, which I think can't evolve. Oh, okay. Wow. Well, that's good to know. I can get a free Eevee. I can get a freebie. Da -da. Meh, 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 meh. Oh, do you reckon it'll survive another scratch? I don't want to risk it. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Come on, Caterpie. Got it. Now, nobody press a name yet, okay? I'm going to say go, and then it's first come, first serve for names, all right? Here we go. We've got a new Pokemon. Wait. 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 Go. Wow, some of you are like, you, you're just on it, aren't you? Okay. We've got one. Wow, look, there they are. Okay, sorry, everyone. Stop, stop. We've got it. Adi Pramana. Adi Pramana. Adit Pramana 7 is the winner with the the equally baffling eel. <laughs> so eel has been added to your party. There we go. Uh, because we can't name Meowth, I might store Meowth and we'll catch something else instead. Right, what else is going on in here? Let's keep going. Oh, We've been got. What's this one? It's another Caterpie! I saw a bunch of those names go up before Ben said go. Mm, but people watch at different different speeds. Sometimes people uh, people's are more in sync than mine. We're going to kill this one. This one's going to die. Okay. I don't know why I'm using a grass type move on it. Never mind. Kill the Caterpie. As you like it, if you give it a refresh, it might be more in sync. Maybe. I know this is difficult. Press L3 to whistle to attract Pokemon. I know. It's a good, it's an interesting new thing. I'm not really sure what the... not really sure what the benefit of that is just yet. What time is it? It's 11 minutes until the Winden Gala region sex number, everybody. So close. Birdseeds is level 8. Puddles is level 3. Birdseeds learned Taunt. Puddles grew to level 3. Yeah, we know that one. Here we go. That Caspi is dead forever. Hooray, Paralyze Heals. Should we get one of these stupid little... Oh, no, they're... Where are the foxes? There are sometimes... I saw a fox in my game. I want to find the fox thing. Ooh! I don't like this one. Blip bug. Awful. I'm going to catch one. I hate it. I'm going to catch one. Taunt into a rage. We'll just scratch it. Let's scratch it. Another random thing is spinning around really fast on the left analog. See what happens. Okay. Let's give that a go. Oh, no. What just happened? He just kicked my ass. 
Quick, let's hope we catch it, otherwise we're about to lose bird seeds. Okay. Okay, we got it. It's okay. Um, that's a good idea, Lord Brotovich. Should I just type go the next time and the first one under my message gets to name it? Yes. Lord Brotovich, it's in your hands. I will give you the I will give you the nod when you can type go, and as soon as you've typed go, people can basically just press enter to t to let their name fly. So we'll see who gets there first, and that way it's fair for everyone. Everybody knows what's going on. Okay, we will understand. Wait to see Lord Brotovich type go. First name that appears under that will be chosen as the name for this disgusting bug thing. Lord Brotovich. Oh my god! <laughs> Jesus, there they all are. Okay, and Balam straight in there with an appropriate name for this creature. Bumpies. Bumpies. There we go. It's done. Bumpus has been added to your party. Okay, we got a Bumpus. Oh my goodness. Whoa! Why is that a thing? Ollie and where yours was a few down from the top for me. Um, so I think I'm not sure. I think it may have just been really tight. I'm afraid it's the first one that pops up on my screen. So that's the only way we can do it. Three people wanted bum face. Don't worry, we will. I'm sure bum bum face will be chosen for a Pokemon soon. I am sure. Uh, okay, How, have I got any spaces in my bag? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, we can catch one more Pokemon. You can catch and evolve... You can evolve a specific Pokemon by doing that spin move. Oh, hello. How weird. Oh, Jesus, it just shoots into the sky. Okay, what do we want? Oh, okay, what's this? It's the stupid thing! Okay, here we go. We're going to catch one of these things. Level 5 as well. Branch Poke, get it! Oh, bird seeds, be careful. Let's see if we can just catch it. That squirrel sucks. <laughs> I know, I hate it too. But we need a full complement of Pokemon, we can always replace it. Oh my god. Pokemon gained XP. Hey, Puddles grew to level 4. Eel grew to level 4. Nah, 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 nah. I would like to give Squova to name. Lord Brotovich. Ugh. Here we go. Get ready, everyone. It's going to happen now. Oh, 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 God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Just looking through these names. The winner was Vexleth on my screen. There's also Love Nuts, Nut Shack, Nut Sacks, Not a Squirrel, Me Nuts, Squir Squirrel Boy, T Peeps, It's Cute, Deez Nuts, Stupid Face, Dave, A Rude Word 23 with Onions, Bad, and Bill from, from uh, Olienware there. Okay, Vexleth with the second Pokemon naming. Fluffer. Alrighty. Oh, ho, ho, naughty! Not allowed. Not allowed. This is a this is a wholesome family game. How dare you? How dare you? Let's try Love Nuts then. Looks like by default it goes to second place, which is the far wall. <laughs> 
That's so funny. I didn't think it would pick up on that. Love. Nuts. Yeah, that's fine. Love Nuts has been added to your party. Fluffer, though, no! <laughs> this is a Christian stream. <laughs> uh, for those unfamiliar, a fluffer is, is, a, is a role within the pornographic industry, which I think actually might be an urban legend. I don't think a fluffer is a real thing, or at least it's not anymore, from what I understand. Not that I, not that I know much about that. Okay, Love Nuts has been added to your party. Here we go. Let's get out of here. We need to go heal up our boy. Our boy's, our boy is dying. Hey, look, it's Charizard. Mah! The ultimate Charizard. Let's go in the station. Welcome to the Pokemart. I'm here to buy. I will buy some potions. Let's get a nice even, even ten of those. Six, that's ten in total. Thank you so much. Get a oh, revives. We don't need those, do we? <laughs> ah, excellent. Do come again. Oh, I will. Just you try and stop me. Can I go to the Pokemon Center? No, there's just people in the way. We can change our threads, though, which I feel like is really important. So it's worth bearing in mind that different shops will sell different clothes. So this shop won't sell every clothing. But we do have different tops. Look, we can be so fashionable. This menu's like super weird. It was doing this for me last night. I pressed down very carefully and sometimes it skips too. It just scrolls twice. Oh, stop. We could spend all of our money on an Arcanine shirt. <laughs> what do you think? All of our money on an Arcanine shirt? It's up to you guys. It'd be really, really irresponsible. Um, because it would be every single bit of our money. All money on a gold duck hat. There's no gold duck hat. There's very few options here. Just some hoodies. Got some skinny jeans. Skinny trousers. Some socks that you can't really see. Long ones. Cropped leggings, apparently, that we can't see. Compression tights. Those are fun. Uh, loaf. We can buy some shoes. As your accountant, this is a financially irresponsible, irresponsible investment. I'm going to do it just because you told me not to. Different bags. Bags. I hate these hats. I don't want any of these hats. These hats are no fun. I don't even really like the bobble hat either. I'm going to wait until I can replace it with something else. Glasses, not really. Everyone's saying get the shirt. I'll get the shirt. Okay, we're doing it, everyone. Here we go. Yeah, that'll be 30,000 pokey dollars. Yes. Yes. Yeah, we did it. Perfect. Look how good we look. What do you mean, what happened to that money I gave you? I spent it. On what? What do you mean on what? On clothes. I can't even afford a pair of gloves now. Excellent. We're done shopping for now. Yes. Wow. Look how good we look, though. Looking great. Looking great. Guys, it is one minute until the Winden sex number. Get ready to blaze it, everybody. If you've been holding back on donating blips or donating dollary dues, now is the time to do it in approximately, in approximately, according to my clock, 10 seconds. It will be the Wyndon sex number. Here we go. There's all the links in the chat if you want to donate. You don't have to. Just being here is wonderful enough. But it is time. It's time, my dudes. It is the sex number. It is 420 in the Winden region in Gala. Blaze it. Blaze it, everyone. Will this be a full playthrough or just a one-off stream? 
Thank you very much, the villain. I'm not sure. I feel like this game could go on for a long time, so we might come back to it, but for now it's just a one-off. Uh, but I would consider coming back to it. It's the sex number. Blaze it, everyone. Blaze it. Blaze it, everybody. B B B B B B B B B B B Blaze it. B B B B B Blaze it. I sent birdseed to my keys. Wait, what? Wait, what? Trailing Badger, thank you so much. Thank you so much. The blips there from As You Like It, BB, 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 Blazes. How Awesome got to catch them all. Thank yeah. you very much. BB, 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 Blaz is. Howey Sun got to catch him all. <laughs> Thank you, As You Like It. Thank you very much. Ah, oh, wow, what a successful sex number. Thank you, everybody. Happy 420. <laughs> Hello? Booyaka, booyaka, 420. <laughs> booyaka, booyaka, be, 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 blaze it, my dudes. Thank you, the villain. Thank you so much. Be, 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 blaze it, my dudes. Well done. You reached the goal and managed to find the Pokemon. <laughs> God, here comes the unit, look. Blaze it, dudes. Wherever and whenever you are. Be, 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 blaze it. <laughs> Whoa. Thank I you, send Stephen. Mikey bird seeds. Bird seeds. Thank you, Stephen. Thank you so much. Thank you. You reached the goal and managed to find the Pokemon Research Lab. You did a far sight better than I did my first time. I'm hopeless with direct. You can see it from everywhere. There's one road. How bad are yeah. you? Directions. It's 420 pp. Poker blaze it. Time, my dudes. Moggy dab. I hope you get to catch a Blazik and real. Soon and I wonder if you need a dank kush stone for you to evil your Snoop Dogg. <laughs> Is blazing even legal in Wind and Moggy HMM? Mm, good question. Thank you, Lord Brotovich. I'm sure blazing it is. It seems very, uh... Oh, it's, it's 422! It's 422. As we all know, that is the sex number as well. 422. It's Wyndham's sex number. It's the Wyndham sex number. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for blazing it. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, we're still going. Stop. There we go. <laughs> ah, and I'm sure glad I've got Charizard with me to keep me from getting lost all the time. Now, in we go! Quah! Oh, look at this place. I've got to give it to Professor Magnolia. Everything in here looks fascinating. Bowark. Bew Whip. Look at that stupid thing. Look at it. It's an electric corgi. What is it today, Leon? Looking for info on another never before seen super strong Pokemon. I wish you'd stop with these outlandish requests. Here she comes. Bloop, 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 bloop. Good to see you too, Yamper. Yamper here is a real champ when it comes to helping you find your way around. He came to my rescue plenty of times back in the day when I got lost on the road. Oh yeah, and that's his trainer, Sonya. <laughs> God. What can I say about Sonia? Well, I like the way she cooks. Leon. Mate. Come on. She makes food you can gobble down in a flash. Great. What kind of an introduction is that? Did you forget we were rivals during our gym challenge? It wasn't just Yampa helping you out. I did too. Yeah, you tell him. Anyway, nice to meet you. Name's Sonia. I'm the professor's assistant. I'm super cool. I've got great hair. Got little hearts in it. This is Ben. He's a new Pokemon trainer. Set him on the right path. Would you? Would you? Oh, there's sponsorships. What does he think I am? He's always got his head in the clouds. It's no wonder he gets lost all the time. Oh. Looks like you've got a Rotom phone. Hi, hey there, Rotom. <laughs> Rotom phones are handy little things, aren't they? They've got a map and a navigation tool. That said, Leon still gets lost, so blah, blah, blah. Yes, I do know a lot about Pokemon, I do. Thank you. Yes, we got the Pokedex. Just so you know, that Pokedex is a gift from my gran. Could you let gran know that you received the Pokedex? She lives in the house down along Route 2. 
We sure can. Look at that shirt. Yes, sir. Uh, worth all the money. Worth all the money. Anyway, there we go. Yamp yamp. Hey there, trainer. Sorry to stop you. Means you've got a Pokedex. I love talking to new trainers and giving them useful stuff. Thank you for the potion, strange man. It's a potion. Use it when your Pokemon's HP, their hit points, gets low. Knowledge is power. Okay. Bye, man. Bye, strange man. Oh, there he is. He's just, he just just walked there. Look at Lieutenant Surge here. Look at man Mountain. God. Oh, Christ. Here he is. Yep, got my Pokedex. It's time to meet lots of different Pokemon to start building up a strong team. But battling strong Pokemon in the wild can leave your team in a bad way, not to mention what battling another trainer can do. Luckily, we've got Pokemon Centers. Yep, we know how Pokemon Centers work. It's where you go to heal your Pokemon. Come on, let's go inside. Alrighty. Level with me, Ben. Is this your first time in a Pokemon Center? Of course not. Yeah, then don't tell me what I already know. If you two kids are Pokemon trainers, you might want to buy some potions before you head out. Thank you. Everyone's always giving me potions. Go away, Hop. Jesus. Welcome to the Pokemart. May I help you? I'd like to buy some. Not allowed to buy any Pokeballs, am I? Let me buy Pokeballs. Do, 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 do. Hello. Uh, write a nickname. Ray Birdseed's nickname. Hmm, Birdseed, is it? That is quite a fine nickname. But I think you can give me something... No! Rude? Yeah, write another Pokemon's name. Ray Meowth's name. Hmm, Meowth, is it? That is quite a fine... This guy just... He doesn't care at all. I think you could give it something better. Yes. What would you like to Here we go, we get to name the Meowth. Lord Brotovich, are you standing by? Do it. Send out the signal. Hang on, hang on, Lord Brotovich hadn't play hadn't sent go yet. People were right in there after he said yes. Okay, trialing badger. Trailing Badger appears first for me. I don't think this one will be blocked. It's a good one. No! Oh, for God's sake, I pressed the wrong button, guys. Let's let's try that again. So sorry, everyone. Sorry, everyone. We're still going with Trailing Badgers because it's only fair. Yes, Meowth, that's a, that's a fine nickname. I think we can give it something better. Yes, yes, here we go. Here we go. There we go. There we go. From now on, this Pokemon should be known as I Am A Cat. Excellent. There we are. You're right. That does seem to fit it better. Nicely done. Nicely done. Shall I rate another Pokemon's name? Yes. Are you just going to say the same thing about everyone? What do you think of Puddles? He just says... He, he doesn't... He's a terrible employee. Get out of here. What do you even do? This is some kind of pub, but you have teapots. You've got a weird fluffy thing there. I don't understand it. I don't, even, I don't understand the world anymore. Heal my pocket monsters. Na, 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 na. Na, 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 na. Thanks for waiting. Grookey and the rest of your team should all be better. Should be all better now. We have to see you again. Off we go in our very cool shirt. Oh god, look, there he is. Just leave me alone, dude. You just, you like my shadow. Everywhere I go, you're always just there. Ugh. Listen, Ben, I've been thinking. If you're a Pokemon trainer now, you must want to try your hand at the gym challenge, right? 
The gym challenge? The gym challenge, mate! The annual competition where trainers trainers can battle it out for the right to challenge the champ the champion. But the trick is you've got to be endorsed if you want to take part, and Lee doesn't think, seem to think I'm up to snuff. So I'm thinking I ought to talk to the professor and see if she could help. That's a great idea. Let's go see the professor then. You don't need to say anything else. You don't need to say anything else. You don't. Let's go. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. The hat really does look like grandma hair. You're right. It does look like a grey bun, doesn't it? There we go. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. That's it. That's where we're going down there. You see the purple house? That's where we're going. Do we have any Pokeballs left? Oh, we have one Pokeball. One Pokeball. Oh, God! I'm okay. I know how to catch Pokemon. I've already got a few. Do -do 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 -do. Uh, you've already caught some on your own. Yes, I know. Your mum gave you those Pokeballs, did she? Yeah. I'll give you some more Pokeballs because I'm the best. I'm better than your mum. Pokemon around here seem easy to catch. Almost like they're itching to join some trainer's team, wouldn't you say? I don't know that I'd say that. But we've got a lot of balls now. You put the Pokeballs in your bags. Pokeballs pocket. Yep. Know how to catch Pokemon. I've done it. I've done it, my dude. Already done it, Leon. Get out of here. Alright, I'm going to catch loads of Pokemon. The professor will be shocked when she sees. Okay, good. Catch a Zigazagoon. If I can spot one, I will catch one. <gasps> Look at this little cat boy or girl. A purloin. Go birdseeds. Okay. We're going to catch this. We're going to catch this. Then I'm going to poke it first. I'm going to poke it first. Hey, yeah! Don't die. Oh, phew. I'm assuming, Reese, that you don't encounter hops as much later on because he is just everywhere at the moment <laughs> and it's so annoying okay okay yes Polon was caught Lord Brotovich are you ready now remember chat when he when he says yes don't post your names yet okay bump his crew to level four excellent do, 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 do. Did you hold down and B? No, I didn't. I should have done that. Those pro gamer, those pro gamer tips. A dark cat. Opponents that get drawn in by its adorable behaviour come away with stinging scratches from its claws and stinging pride from its laughter. It laughs at you. It scratches it and laughs at you. Sir John Snow, thank you very much for the resub. Congrats on your purloin. Thank you, Sir John Snow. Would you like to give purloin a nickname? Yes, I would. Lord Brotovich! <laughs> I don't even understand half of these. But the far wall is first for me. So it's going in. Cancel cat. Well, there we go. The cancel cat is there. Now, I am going to start shuffling around my party. When I remove a Pokemon, it's not because I don't like the name. It's just because I'm not a fan of the Pokemon, okay? So please don't take it personally if you've named a Pokemon. I just like the idea of a cat Pokemon more than I like the idea of a weird little bug Pokemon. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to swap it. I'm going to swap it out. Let's add it to my party. We'll swap it for... 
Puddle, I'm sorry. Puddles is Puddles is gone for now. Puddles is gone to the PC box. There we go. So it's safe. But Cancel Cat is in. Also, look, there's that fox thing I was talking about earlier. I want to catch one of those. I like that. Oh, no! Bird Seeds is unsafe! Bird Seeds is unsafe and will be consumed by the bird. We need to run. We need to get out of here now. Run, 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 run. Get out of there. Oh. Oh. Oh, that was close. Oh. Whew. Thank you very much, Fred the Shed, for watching. Take care. Have a good evening. Here we go. Let's get a nice, let's get a nice, like a sexy fox. Look at that sexy fox. N nick it is what it's called. Let's nick the fox. Do, 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 do. You know how in your Dark Souls run you you grinded off screen? Can you do that with this playthrough so we can see the whole game? I don't really want to do that because, and I'll tell you why. Because I want to play the game and enjoy it for me. And I've already got a playthrough that I'm doing for me. And I don't really want to juggle two playthroughs. So if we're going to play through some more, we will continue to play through it if people want me to continue to play through it. But I probably won't play it off screen just because I'm just because I'm playing my own one for my own enjoyment, and I don't want to I don't want to have to do both at the same time. I hope that makes sense. I'd already played a lot of Dark Souls by the time I was doing my Dark Souls run, so it wasn't uh, it wasn't it wasn't such a such a big deal for me. Uh, okay, let's let's catch this let's catch this this boy. That is a blazed looking fox. It's going to be our blazed looking fox soon. Oh, don't beat me up. Okay, here we go. Let's catch it. Yes! I mean, I don't know what I need to do for these Pokemon to, to, to kick out, to use wrestling terminology. But nobody seems to be kicking out, which, you know, is, you know, it's, it's no problem, it's no problem, there we go. Um, oh, look at all the levels we've got up, oh, my god. Bird Seeds grew to level 9. I Am A Cat grew to level 6. Eel grew to level 5. That means Eel's gonna evolve, I was gonna say explode, that's not the right, I hope not. Bumpus grew to level 5. Excellent stuff. Into the phone we go. Nickit's data will be added to the Pokedex. Lord Brotovich, are you ready? Now remember, Lord Brotovich is going to type yes to begin with. And to confirm that Lord Brotovich is ready, I will then nod to Lord Brotovich, at which point Lord Brotovich will type OK in the chat. As soon as OK is typed... 23... Look, stop! 23 with onions, Stephen Scodes. Stop it, the villain. You're all getting it wrong. As soon as Lord Brotovich types OK, that is the moment. That is the moment. And the first name that's under Go, that's when you type the name. Okay, people are still <laughs> typing names. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's OK. We'll get it right. When I nod to Lord Brotovich, he types OK. That's the time. Cunning and cautious, this Pokemon survives by stealing food from others. It erases its tracks with swipes of its tail as it makes off with its plunder. Look at that. Look at that tail there. Okay. I would like to give it a nickname, Lord Brotovich. Here we go. <laughs> People are still doing it. Stop. Oh my god. There they all are. There are all the names. Badger of Science. Badger of Science is in there. With a pretty sexy name, actually. Hopefully the Nintendo, the children's Nintendo game allows it. Lots of great suggestions, though. Bedroom Eyes. Where do you want to send Bedroom Eyes to? I would actually quite like Bedroom Eyes in my, in my party. We're going to swap it out for... I have nothing against Bumpus. You all know I love a good Bumpus. We're going to swap out this weird looking bug for Bedroom Eyes. And we should get an Evolve now if I know my evolutions, right? No? Then that's weird. Because I swear, normally, Caterpie evolves to Metapod at level 5, right? And then Metapod to Butterfree at level 10. I don't know if that's been changed. I might be wrong, though. Oh, hello. Oh, 
Can't believe Ben is a bug racist. Oh god, look, see there, the, the revenge of the bumpiest. There it is. It's come to, it's come to attack. It's come to attack now. I'm just gonna kill it. Oh no, not very effective. Oh god, the bumpiest is gonna kill me. I'm gonna die from bumpiest. No, bumpiest, please. Bumpiest, please. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> I didn't even mean to do that. Okay, we escaped the bumpus. This is a new one. Who's this little guy? Oh, look at the tutel. Would I consider a run of Dark Souls 2? Maybe Dark Souls 2 is really long. Like, I feel like it kind of outstays its welcome. Maybe. Maybe at some point. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Okay, let's get the tootle. Uh, now remember, when it comes to names, we don't want any nasty, rude names, okay? They will be ignored, so it'll be good. Goodbye, Sir John, so, Sir John, Sir John, God, I need to enunciate better. Sir John Snow, thank you very much. Uh, enjoy class, thank you for watching. Do, 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 do. I think you can get one more scratch in there. Just want you to know my team of 35 hours could destroy your bird seeds. Hashtag brag. Damn, King Uendo. Remind me not to cross you. You sound like a radical dude. I'd best watch myself. Okay, here we go. Now remember, Lord Brotovich saying yes, that's not when you type. Lord Brotovich saying okay, that's when you type. Yes. Lord Brotovich, are you ready and standing by? <laughs> Did I get it wrong? Okay. We're changing it. We're changing it now, I've decided, because I just made it more confusing. Okay, so Lord Brotovich says yes to confirm that he's ready, and when it is time to type a name, he will type name. Okay? He will type name. The word name. Lord Brotovich. <laughs> oh, wow, look at it go. Wow. There's a lot of great ones in there. Uh, for me, though, Badger of Science has got in again. We've got back-to-back -back Badgers of Science. Let's see if I can get this in there. If it has enough, I don't know if it will have enough letters, but we'll try. We only get 12. No, it's not going to have enough room, Badger of Science. It's not going to have enough room. It was Special Squirtle was Badger of Science's suggestion. So by default, we're going down to, to Sontailsick. Sontailsick is naming this one. Oh, I've pressed, oh, I've cancelled it. <laughs> we'll go back to the man. The man will help us. Hang on. We'll swap it for, we'll swap it for Love Nuts. Uh, place the bison in my bag. Okay, okay, good. Right, come on, quickly. He's got no name, out of my way. He's got no name. Out of my way, he's got no name, we must hurry. He's got no name. He's got no name, get out of the way. Out of the way, everyone, he's got no name. He's got no name, run. Guys, he's got no name. I've got a Pokemon with no name here. Got a Pokemon with no name. Rate my Pokemon's nickname, please help me. Make me whole again. Help. Help me. I think we give it, yeah, I think you could. It's got no name. Huh. Okay. Okay. Oh my God. Huh. We're good. It's David, it's David B. Phillips, everyone. It's David B. Phillips. Oh no, it's David B. Philly! Damn it! Sontail sick, it's too long! It's too long. 
Which means we default to third place. Stephen. Stephen Scotes, you've done it. You made the cut, my dude. Oh god, the, the thumbstick is so hard to use. T Peeps joins the team. What a rigmarole. From now on, this Pokemon will be known as T Peeps. T Peeps. You're right, that does seem to fit it better, nicely done. No, you don't need to write anything else. You've done you've done your grim grim work. Get away from me. Ah, oh, there we go. We're off. No bum faces in there. Uh Nike West West on IO, I'm afraid. Here we go. Oh, look, it's a little it's the little pup. Let's get us let's get ourselves a pup. <laughs> Go bird seeds. Get us a yamper. <laughs> Don't you nozzle. Okay, it's fine. It doesn't do any damage. <laughs> Best all get thinking of your names that you want. I'm going to get me a Yamper. <laughs> ben, that's just someone's dog. I'm so sorry. He's my dog now. Look at me. He's my dog now. It's my dog. Look. Look. Look at it. It's my dog now. It's my dog now. Okay. Okay. <laughs> It's my wife now, Dave. Cancel Cat grew to level 6. Bedroom Eyes grew to level 6. Who's going to get this one? Yampa's data will be added to the Pokedex. Lord Brotovich, are you ready? This gluttonous Pokemon only assists people with their work because it wants treats. Just like me. As it runs, it crackles with electricity. Oh my god, it's me! I would like to give it a nickname. Lord Brotovich! Oh god, that was so fast. There's so many in there. <laughs> Mystery Sender. In there first. In there first. With... Oh. No. Oh god. I'm trying to use the, the PS4 buttons to type, and it's different. With my dog now. My dog now. We're in there with, it's my dog now. Mm, what do you want to send my dog now? It's going into my party. And it's going to replace Eel. Eel's going to take a little break in the, in the PC box. My dog now will be added to your party and Eel will be sent to a box. Here's something I want to know about this game that I really liked about Let's Go Eevee and Let's Go Pikachu. Wee whip! Is that you could, um, you could have, oh, there's a Zigazagoon. We were going to get one, weren't we? You could, you could have a, you could take a Pokemon out of their ball and they would follow you around in that game. And I really liked that. I wish that was an option in this game too. Why is that not an option? I want to be able to, I want to be able to have like my little bird seeds follow me around. Oh, and in one. <laughs> Easy, meth badger. Well, you best get ready, Louis. Lord Brotovich, are you standing by and ready? No, 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 no. Calm him down with some mashed potato. Level 10. Here we go. Thought to be the oldest form of Zigazagoon, or Zigzagoon, sorry. 
It moves in zigzags and wreaks havoc upon its surroundings. Would you like to give Zigzagoon a nickname? Yes. Lord Brotovich. Sure. Gotta be ready to scroll up because this is gonna be real far, oh, my god. King Uendo in there first with a great suggestion, if I do say so myself. It's scary spice. There we go. Where do you want to send scary spice? I'm gonna add it to my party. Let's let's shake things up a bit. We'll keep hmm. I feel like every time we get a new one, an old one should be replaced. Not replaced, but just sent to the bank. Let's change I am a cat. And we'll get we'll get scary spice added to my party. And I am a cat will be sent to your box. There we go. Excellent. Okay. Right, let's get to this blooming house. Uh oh. It's Tiny Peter and he means business. I do actually need to heal my Pokemons because uh, they're all a bit worse for wear. Let's do a paralyzed heal on bird seeds. There we go. Potions. Lovely stuff. As I say, my dog now is level seven. Get that one up. Okay, let's beat up Peter. Tiny Peter. Nope. <laughs> Regret saying that. Okay. It's common manners for Pokemon trainers to battle when their eyes meet. Oh, here we go. Let's get this sick battle music raging, my dudes. Got him. How's that? That, uh, that an appropriate level? We got him. We kicked his ass. We kicked his arse. Get out of my way. We've got all the Pokemon we need. Trainer tips. Pokemon. Oh, I know how to get XP. God, game. Stop it. Wee. Where are you going? Oh, it's gone. Oh, delicious balls. Okay, who's this? Who's this lady? Oh, I keep thinking I'm spotting Pikachu in the grass, but I'm not, and it's getting me really... making me sad. Hello there! Cute and strong, together in combination. We beat down a child, and now it's time to beat up a woman. Here we go. Go bird seeds. Peterina. Oh, mate, why did you even come to school today? Huh? Awful. Sorry, Lassleron. Are we cute and nothing more? It looks like our strength still has a ways to go. I believe in you, Lauren. You just gotta train up and keep getting stronger every day. Life is a learning experience, and just because you don't succeed today doesn't mean that you won't succeed tomorrow. Believe in your dreams and keep pushing forward. That's the way it's gonna be. And if it's not gonna be like that, then I'm sorry. But maybe you won't cut out for it to begin with. Well, that's okay, because maybe there's things you're better at. And, you know, people are better at certain things than others. And maybe you just need to work at that instead. What I'm trying to say, Les Lauren, is that I think you're great and you'll continue to be great as long as you want to be great. Mm. 
Oh my god, I'm just getting just getting spotted by all these beasties. Look at this tiny creeper over there. Look at can we get a zoom on that? What's up with this guy? Look at him. Oh. He's not even that well hidden. Oh let the game let Hang on. Let the game Oh, you're entering the danger zone now, my dude. Danger let's what if we sneak up on him? Hey idiot. Ooh! I couldn't beat Hop, but I'm gonna beat you. Well, I beat Hop, so that makes you especially bad. Oh, it's youngster Benjamin. How weird. Go bad, seeds. Punch him. I'm gonna. Watch me. Scritch. Birdseeds used Scritch. Oh! Don't hit me with that. Birdseed. Special attack fell. Gonna scratch that bug. Your Pokemon gained exp points. Scary Spice grew to level 6 and learned Lick! Great! Bedroomize grew to level 7. Youngster Benjamin is about to send out Nickit. Will you switch Pokemon? I think I will. Let's send out my, my dog now. Come on, my dog. Get him, my dog now. Oh, he's got Bedroomize too. Uh, Nuzzle, go get him. Oh no! My chunk dog. Oh, this is going to be a tedious battle, isn't it? God. It's paralysed, though. Let's just keep electrocuting the dog. Ah! Nuzzle. This is it. This is it, my dog, now. You can get him. Ah, oh, this is outstanding. Tail whip? No, don't you use status effect. Don't stop that. You lower my defence. How dare you? Yeah, thank you Lord Rotovich. See you in chat. You like this new shirt I'm wearing? It's a brand new design from Carrie. Showed it off at the start of the stream. Look, triple... Well, hang on, what does it say? Triple Jump Warus Clan official member is what it says. You can buy this bad boy right now at triplejump.mup forward slash shop. Get him. Kill the fox. Kill that fox. Kill the fox. Get the fox. Kill the fox. Make the fox dirt. Make the fox dirt. <laughs> no. Let's tackle it to death. Hi. 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 Ah. Yes. Got him. Excellent. My dog now grew to level eight. Cancel cat grew to level seven. It's all going our way. Lose to wild Pokemon. Lose to many trainers. Oh man. <gasps> he picked up. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Look. Here's the professor! So have you unraveled all the secrets of the Dynamax phenomenon yet? Oh goodness no, the whole thing is still full of questions. I'd hope that my granddaughter would take over my research, but... <laughs> that man has fabulous legs. <laughs> he does, they're great legs. Should we look at them? What oh, wonderful legs. Dear me, I'm sorry, I didn't even notice my my guests, I had of guests. Hello, guests. My name's Magnolia. There she is. There's your tree name for the professor. I think Magnolia is a tree, is it, or is it just a flower? I have no idea. Welcome, young trainers. Now come, let's head indoors. What a lovely grandma. <sighs> what 
Why hop, dear? I see Wu Lu has made some new friends. And you must be Ben! I trust you received the Pokedex from Sonya. I'm sure you'll have it complete in no time. You must already know about Dynamaxing, right, Ben? Professor Magnolia has been doing research into the Dynamax phenomenon for years and years, and it takes a proper understanding of the thing if you plan to use Dynamaxing to the fullest. There you go again, Leon, always talking about Pokemon. There are other things that are worth knowing about too, you know? Like how many different types of tea there are. Shh, yeah. Hey, Professor, do us a favour, would you? Help me convince Lee that he should endorse us for the gym challenge. Oh, Leon, why wouldn't you endorse them? Hop and Ben only just started out as Pokemon trainers, blah, 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 blah. Dearie, I thought your dream was to have everyone in the Galar region become strong trainers. Isn't that right? Well... Yeah, you're not wrong. That goal's precisely the reason I gave them both Pokemon, in fact. He's doing it again. Yes, yes, boys, yes! In fact, can I do this? Let me see if I can do this. I feel like I have the technology to do this. Give me a second. No, wrong way. Yes. 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 Got him. Look at that. Just excited about Pokemon, aren't we? Gonna do the gym challenge, yeah? Gonna do it. Mm hmm Yeah. There it is. This is what you will pay for. <laughs> okay. I've got to try and put it back in the right place now. There you go. That's about right. Are we, are we good? Yeah, I think we're good. We're good. Okay. Right. <clears throat> Let's see if the two of you can show me such a brilliant battle that I'm left with no choice but to endorse you. And don't worry, I'll make sure both your teams are in good shape before the battle starts. Oh, look, I forgot how cool my shirt is, though. Oh, look at it. <laughs> 30 grand. 30 grand. This thing is a revelation, isn't it? I love this little street deck. We're going to get a lot of stupid use out of this, for sure. Okay, I'm not going to say hello to you, Grandma. You appear to have stuffed a bird and are holding it. Holding it there like a walking stick. That's fine. Let's go beat up my friend. Let's go beat up my friend. I know there's a Pokeball over here. What's the goodie for me? Oh, great. That's a great ball. That's a, what a fantastic ball. Doo -doo -boo. Oh, oh, dead. Oh, hello. Secret treat. Fresh water in the plant pot. How fresh is it though, really? Hurry it up, Ben. You've got to battle me so I can get myself that endorsement. What about me? I'm getting the endorsement too. He's very self-obsessed, isn't he, this guy? There he goes. Yes, boy. I'm going to become the greatest Pokemon trainer there is. And to do that, I need the endorsement. We know. We know. We heard. We've heard all about it. Let's just fight now, please. There's also an item behind the house. Ooh, okay. I'm rather interested in seeing how you two young trainers battle too. That's not very good writing, is it? How about as well? You said two and you and all sorts in there. Come on. Listen, you two. The reason I'm undateable is because I learn from every battle I see or take part in. That's how I've gotten to where I am today. Something encouraging. Are you ready to fight? Will you fight me, Ben? I will. Let's fight. Here we go. You want to hear the sax? Let's get this sax going. Kill him, Ben. I'm going to kill him. I'm going to kill this boy.
Beauty Plum Bike. Bird! No! Uh, 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 um, 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 go, my dog, now! Go, 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 go! My dog. My dog's gonna. Oh, super effective. Here we go. Kill him. Kill that bird. Ah. Oh, I didn't do much, did it? Well, look at you. Seems you really. Okay. Didn't want to read that anyway. Justin, welcome to the Warriors Clan. Thank you for the subscribe. Welcome. Here we go. Go get him, bird seeds. Sobble is weak, dude. I'm gonna poke him to death. Pokemon are bad and you should feel bad. Da 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 bad. How's that? Is that an appropriate volume? Hopefully that's fine. First try solo dip. Yeah. Oof. Gutted that I lost. But I expect nothing less from my rival. And I even got my Pokeball throw perfect too. I didn't realise that was an aspect of it. The sting of defeat and the joy of victory. I guess going through both is the key to the two of us getting stronger, right? Well, I mean, maybe you. I'm just going to win. I will only win. You, though, I feel uh, is prob you're probably going to lose a lot first. Well, after seeing a match like that one, I suppose I've little choice but to give you both an endorsement as champion. There you go. There you go. A letter of endorsement. You put the letter of endorsement in your bag's key items pocket. A letter of recommendation that you'll need in order to participate in the gym challenge. Do, 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 do. Thanks, Lee. I swear I'm going to win my way through the gym challenge to reach you. You may both be young still and plenty, plenty rough around the edges. That's not a very British term, but it was a proper battle. Christ, what a sentence that was. Charles and I were both feeling the excitement in every last cell of our bodies. Hop, you've always tended to get caught up in things like how you throw your Pokeball out. Things that have nothing to do with real strength. Honestly, I'd be worried about you still obsessing over some of that nonsense, but it seems you've really grown a bit, little brother. And I'd like to see some more thrilling Pokemon battles out of you too, Ben. I will, Leon, I promise. Are you sure? I will. I'm going to do it for you, Leon. That's great. Maybe you'll be as close as I am to my Charizard. I don't know about any... I don't know about... What do you mean? I don't know about that. I mean, you just... What? I don't... What's the problem? I just don't... I just think it's a bit weird. I just think you're a bit weird. I just... I just love my Pokemon. I just think it's... A, I think you're a bit... I think you're weirdly close to Charizard. 
You just, you, it makes me uncomfortable. Oh. Okay. Yeah, so. I mean, I'll train, and I'll do it for me, but I'm not gonna do it. You're not gonna do it for me? No, I'll, I'll do it for me. Okay. Alright. Just stop having sex with your Charizard, dude. It's weird. Anyway. <clears throat> Alright, Ben. You and me are going to train up against one another to aim for the champion's title. Against one another? What? That's the way of it when you've got a great rival. Why well, I don't know about that. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> that reaction was a bit much, wasn't it? Huh? What's that? Whoa! A shooting star! What is this? Ben, would you look at this? They're wishing stars! Since there are two of them, I will take both and you can watch me use them. Thanks, Hop. You obtained a wishing star. You put the wishing star in your bag's key item pockets. Charizard makes me wear booty shorts, please help. <laughs> God. Uh, great. A stone found in the Gala region with a mysterious power. It's said that your dreams will come true if you find one. Oh my goodness. With one of these, my Pokemon can Dynamax. They're gonna be massive, yes! Is Trubbish in this game? Can somebody do a quick Google, find out if Trubbish is in this game? Trust you to pull something like this. They say wishing stars fall down for those who have a true wish in their heart, you know. I will be the greatest trainer ever. Oh, it is, okay. If we find a Trubbish, we'll call it Lord Brotovich. That's a promise. I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the... Jesus, mate. You're a bit... The shouting was a bit much for me. There, I've said it three times, so surely my wish will come true now, right? Don't be silly, Hop. Those wishing stars are composed of a curious sort of rock containing unknown power. They are one of the most precious resources we have here in the Gala region. But they won't do a thing for you in that state. Give them to me, and I'll I'll take I'll take care I'll take good care of them. All oh, right, you've done heaps of research into Dynamax, blah blah blah. Give them give Ben and me the power to Dynamax our Pokemon. First we battle against that mad Pokemon, the Slumbering Wield, and now this. Root feels like we're getting caught up in the adventure of a lifetime. If we get a Jigglypuff, Cecil prompts, yes, we will call it Cecil. Promise. Really feels like we're getting caught up in the adventure of a lifetime. I do understand your excitement, young man, but don't get carried away. You want to save your energy for tomorrow's journey. Are we going to have dinner? Oh, Jesus, where did you come from? Seems I came back home in time for all the excitement. Hey, you lot. Why not have some dinner? You must be hungry, right? I've been totally obsessed with making the latest trendy curries. I love trendy curries. Ah, oh, nice little sleep. Everybody rehydrate. Everybody do a rehydrate. Ah. <sighs> We're just telling them about the weird fog dog again. <clears throat> A right fount of information you are. Yeah, take that, Hop. Ben, Hop, these are for you. What have we got? Oh, sweet bracelet. Oh, sweet shirt, though. Why does it keep zooming? Is it going to stop zoom? Oh, there we go. <laughs> it's just going to zoom forever. You got a Dynamax band from Professor Magnolia and slipped it on your wrist. A wishing star has been affixed to it. It lets out a light that allows Pokemon to Dynamax when at a power spot. Those are your Dynamax bands. I made them by fitting the wishing stars you found last night into those bands. Great. Thanks, Professor. This is brilliant. It's just like the one Lee has on him, too. Now we can Dynamax our Pokemon. When will you learn? When will you learn? 
My word, you don't waste any time, do you? I think you'll find it's not so simple as all that. There are a number of conditions you must meet if you hope to have your Pokemon Dynamax and take on that gigantic form. Now don't be afraid to go to all sorts of places and meet all sorts of Pokemon. That will help you fill out your Pokedex too. The legend of my reign is finally about to begin. Come on, Ben. I'll beat you to the station. Ah, oh, he's gone. Oh, he's finally gone. Well, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's time to save the progress for today and and take take a little break. We ended up with bird seeds, scary spice, cancel cat, my dog now, bedroom eyes, and tea peeps with a Pokemon. That ended our stream. Maybe we'll add more next time. Maybe we won't play any more next time. Maybe we'll play something else. Who's to say? I will ask on Twitter and uh, and find out what people want me to play more of. But until then, thank you so much for um, for coming along. Thank you for watching. Thank you for donating. Uh, this shirt, as I said, is available right now. This brand new Walrus shirt. Triple J dot up forward slash shop. Uh, tomorrow, we are... Oh, what's happening tomorrow? I think we're shooting some more stuff, which is exciting. But on Friday, there will be a, uh, a cut content episode going out with a guest on it. And Saturday is the big one. We're streaming right here on Twitch, a charity stream in aid of Cats Protection League. Uh, that'll be Saturday, 4pm uh, till 7pm. I think we're on directly after, uh, after friend of the channel, Boof, who's up there. So Boof is streaming before us, then it will be us. And then I believe it is Radders from the Yogs cast directly after. So it'll be a good day of streams to watch if you if you you know if you want to watch some streams. But we'll be there 4 till 7. Please uh, give what you can. Your support in being there means the world. But this money isn't coming to us. It will be going to charity. And we're going to Cats Protection League. And uh, we've, we've posted all about it on Twitter and Facebook. And we'll continue to do so for the rest of the week. But until then... Thank you so much for watching, everybody. I am going to have a wee and then go home and have some dinner. That's what I'm going to do. Take care, everybody. Bye.